Good afternoon folks, Big Bo here with another great Diesel Class A value from Parkway RV Center. <clears throat> Y'all forgive me folks, I'm kind of suffering the after effects of a cold so my voice is a little raspy. <clears throat> I haven't had one of these in a, in a year or so and I love these Safari motorhomes. I mean these things are just pretty much top of the line. About as nice as you can get without getting into like the Prevost and the Bluebirds and stuff like that. This is a 36 PDD. This is a certified pre-owned Class A motorhome. Now folks, we have to go through a lot of time and trouble and money to get one certified. And what that means is I have to have an independently, an independent certified RV tech that does not work for us has to come out. I have to pay him to do a 138 point inspection. I have to send multiple photos to the certification company for their RV techs to review. They have to do an extensive title and accident history check to make sure there's no problems. And if it passes all of that stuff, then they give me the certification to make it a certified pre-owned RV instead of just a used, a regular used motorhome. Uh, you know, a lot of dealers don't go through the time and trouble, but we do, folks. After 48 years in business and tens of thousands of motorhomes and travel trailers sold, our customers expect and deserve the best. And that's what you get with a certified pre-owned or CPO motorhome. This unit has got 36,000 miles. It's a 37 foot long with two slides, full body paint, certified pre-owned. It comes with a 90 day nationwide warranty that is extendable. You know, another benefit of a CPO RV over a regular used RV. Uh, my lenders have special finance rates, which are lower for a CPO than for a regular used RV, so that's going to save you money. Plus, you get a 24-hour roadside assistance and a 24-hour RV tech hotline you can call to talk to an RV tech. Plus, a lot of insurance companies, when you buy a certified pre-owned RV, will even give you discounts on insurance, depending on who your insurance company's with. Folks, this thing's like new. I mean, it's 36,000 miles. These are about 200 grand new, and this got 36,000 miles for 64.9, a 2004 model. It's a beautiful RV. Uh, these were pretty much, like I said, top of the line. They're built by Monaco. This is their top of the line unit. The Safaris are built up in Oregon, so designed for cold weather. Notice a mural on the back. Monaco actually has a artist come out and paint a custom mural on the back of every single Safari RV. These aren't decals. This is a hand painted by an artist, and every one of them is different. And they actually have the expense of that. Of course, when you spend what these things cost new, you know, you kind of expect the best. That's what you get. Both slide, top, both slide outs have awning toppers, full body paint, no stripes. Everything's painted on, clear coated over. So you, this thing's going to look this good 20 years from now. 7,500 watt diesel generator runs great. It's got that big 350 Cummins, which is more than enough power for a 37-foot diesel. I mean, if you, you can run 80, 90 miles an hour in this coach if you wanted to. I mean, this thing is got all the power you could ever need if you need to tow something. So tow pretty much anything you want to put behind it. Allison 3000 transmission. Just a great-looking RV. It's got the power awning. Now, folks, I... We just got this unit in. The certification just came in. One thing I do have to do to this RV, and I want to point this out to you. In fact, I even had to tell the uh, certification company in writing I was going to do this before they were certified. These Alcoa wheels are notorious for the wheel centers coming off on the front, and both front wheel centers are missing. I, I've got those ordered, and I am replacing them. Most RV dealers are not going to go through the time and trouble and the money to replace those wheel centers. I mean, I, I spent about $300 for two wheel centers to fit this RV. And like I said, that's something most RV dealers are not even going to bother to do on a 2004 model coach. But folks, when you're buying from the best place in the world to buy a used RV, which is Parkway RV Center, you're going to get the best and you're going to get a nice product. So new wheel centers will be installed when you pick this RV up or we deliver it. 
I'm going to tell you folks, this is a quality, quality coach. No doubt, all fiberglass exterior, fiberglass roof, no maintenance. Notice this cap that goes around the back and the front. That eliminates straight edges where most leak problems occur. Look at the large overlap on the roof. That's another sign of a well-built RV because most leak issues are going to occur on straight edges where they're not covered. In other words, corner edges. The way this RV is built, folks, it's you're not going to have leak problems with it. I mean, the overlap goes all the way down to the edge of the door on the front and the back. You know, one thing you always want to look for, you want to look for a high quality built RV and that's exactly what you get with this. I mean, you never want to buy the cheap, what I call filler brands like your Dutchman's, your Coachman's and stuff like that. Because folks, they're, when they get to be the age of this 2004, they're falling to pieces. When you buy and invest in a good quality brand like this, you're going to get something that's going to last you and your families for decades not just years of trouble-free RV use. It's certified, so you get a 90-day warranty. Full heated basement, four seasons model. These are built up in Oregon, so they're designed for pretty much any kind of weather North America can throw at you. I'm gonna tell you folks, it's a, man, it's a beautiful RV. I mean, that full body paint, that custom mural on the back, that's factory. It's, you know, I mean, even look there on the mud flap. You've got chrome on the mud flap. 350 Cummins ISC diesel, turbo diesel. Wow. Power awning. It's got a door awning as well, plus the slide out toppers. Alcoa wheels. The tires look great. Power step. Let's take a look inside this 36 PDD Safari Sahara. And everything's inside just how we got it in, folks. I mean, we haven't even cleaned this RV yet. Like I said, I had an RV tech come out, do the 138-point inspection. Everything passed with flying colors. And folks, uh, when you buy this RV, my own in-house RV techs with over 20 years of experience are going to take it to our shop and go through it and go way beyond the 138-point inspection to make sure everything works like it's supposed to. Now, folks, I'm going to point out something the previous owners did, which I can understand why they did it, because I'm kind of the same way about TVs and stuff. And we are going to put new TVs in here. The previous owners removed the TVs and put artwork up to cover the TV holes. I wouldn't have gone through that much trouble because TVs are so inexpensive now that time you buy the print, hang it up, you probably could have just replaced the TVs, but... A lot of people, including myself, don't watch a lot of TVs and RVs. I mean, I've owned my RV for over four years. My TV's maybe been on three or four times in all the dozens of times I've used my own Winnebago. I mean, it's uh, nothing I have a use for, but I know a lot of you have kids. A lot of you have like to watch TV and sports. So rest assured, we're taking this artwork down. We're going to put a TV back there, a flat screen TV to fit the hole. So you can you can count on that, but um, and I'm I'm sure there's a lot of you out there probably rather have the picture. So you know if you decide you want to buy this RV, if you'll call us if we haven't put a TV in yet. If you just want to keep the picture up there, let us know. We'll we'll leave it up there. Very comfortable flex steel. It's got that soft leather material. Captain's chairs, power, uh, swivel both swivel for party seating. You've got another soft leather recliner with footrest, table and chairs, sleeper sofa. This is a four sleeper. You know, this is only 37 foot, which is relatively small for a diesel motorhome. But it's got a lot of nice room, a lot of nice features. You got real Corian countertops, you got ceramic tile floor. Obviously, it's got a great riding chassis because none of these ceramic tile floors are cracked. None of these ceramic tiles. You know, if you get into a motorhome that's uh, got ceramic tile floor, that's a great way to check how good the chassis is because if you see several of these ceramic tiles that are cracked and you've got some ride issues with the RV and you need to have that addressed or maybe look at something else. Uh, really nice Corian countertops. And I like the fact I actually put a real Corian sink in here instead of a, just a stainless steel sink. 
Of course, you know, these are pretty much Monaco's top of the line series is the Safari. And they pretty much pull out all stops when they build these. And what's bad is this is considered pretty much the base model of the Monaco line. And this thing's nicer than most top of the line in the other brands. But like I said, Safaris, you're talking 200,000 new. They're not a cheap brand by no means. Corian countertops, you got a stove top, you got a microwave confection oven. All uh, you got all this fluorescent lighting. I'm gonna tell you folks, it's uh, furnace works real good. I've got the furnace on right now and it's hot as a sauna in here. All the books, you got books and manuals here. The previous owner kept all the service records and I think this guy that had this thing was a little eccentric, uh, especially with the, what he did with the TVs, but he actually took this thing and had the oil analyzed at 5,000 and 10,000 miles and put records in here. And, and you know, I, if those of you who want to send off your oil to have it analyzed, that's fine. But I don't recommend doing that until your motorhome gets at least 100,000 miles. It's kind of pointless. A uh, three, five, 10,000 mile motorhome or even 36,000 mile motorhome in a diesel is, is just like new. There's no reason to send the oil off to get analyzed. But this guy did all the results in there of course it passed with flying colors there's no problem there and you're certainly welcome to do that but i really it's kind of a waste of money till you get over a hundred thousand miles and even then it's kind of questionable i mean you you got to realize these diesel motor homes with that big 350 cummins they put that same motor in these big semi trucks towing 60 70 80 000 pounds going down the highway pretty much 24 7 and Think about it, folks. This motorhome doesn't weigh anywhere near what those other Cummins diesels are towing, and they run a million miles or more before the engine's even sent in for an overhaul. So you're going to get seven, eight hundred thousand miles on this diesel before you really have to worry about overhauling motors or anything like that. And I don't know about you, but I've never met anybody that's going to put five, six hundred thousand miles on a diesel motorhome. I mean, you honestly will never wear this machine out. This diesel generator is going to last you from now on, too. I mean, it's just like a diesel motor. They just keep running and running and running. As long as you keep the service and maintenance up on this RV, you're never going to have an issue with the motor or the generator. Unless you just run 100, 150,000 miles a year, which is pretty much physically impossible for one of these. But I guess it could be done if somebody really tried. But you don't have to worry about that, folks. 36,000 miles, certified pre-owned. Pretty much the best and the best in used RVs. And this thing is priced to sell quickly. Let's continue on with the tour. These are all solid wood cabinets. Same grade of cabinets you'd put in your own home. Got the upgrade Norco two-way RV refrigerator freezer with built-in ice maker. Works great on gas and electric. I love the fact that they didn't waste any space in here for storage. I also like the fact this hallway curves to the side because this will give you maximum privacy in the bedroom. I'm going to cut that furnace off real quick because it is warm in here and it's about 45 degrees outside. But folks, back here in the back, you know, this kind of gives you an extra privacy measure. Uh, you do have a sliding door for maximum privacy if you want to shut it off. Queen Island bed. All original uh, factory mattress. It's got the rear closet in the back with plenty of hanging space. I'm not a big fan of these, but you do have a washer and dryer and we'll make sure it works, of course. Probably never be used after we check it out, but you know, it does have one in case you ever have a need for it. Again, they put a picture over where the TV goes, but now this one actually has a TV behind it. So we're going to leave that TV in it since it fits the hole perfectly. But we are going to put a brand new TV in the front and take that picture down. Lots of closet and drawer space. Good solid wood cabinets. Really nice bedroom area you've got two ducted roof airs on the roof it's got electric heat pump it's got a propane furnace got everything you need folks and this is a nice motor home and, and you have to remind yourself this is only 37 foot long which for these high-end models like this and i was talking to a customer about this the other day it seems like most of your high-end models 
like your safaris, your monacos, your tascas, your high-end ones, they don't build a small diesel motorhome. Everything they build is 40, 41, 42 foot plus. And uh, this one to be only 37 foot and be a safari is pretty impressive and very hard to find. Got a glassed in shower, even the, I mean, it's even got metal plumbing fixtures. Skylight looks great, no signs of leak damage. Notice this padded headliner. That really helps reduce road noise when you're driving down the road and helps insulate the coach and reduce noise at the campground. Uh, you've got a porcelain upgrade, porcelain RV toilet, Sea Land. Uh, another Corian top, Corian sink. This is a seamless one, so you don't have to worry about caulking it up or, or you know, having to worry about lit water getting between the sink and the countertop. It doesn't have any of that. Fantastic vent fan. And everything's enclosed in the side. There's no reason to block access to the rear bedroom. You know, I, don't, I like a walkthrough bath for the room, but... The downside to those walk-through baths is when somebody's in the restroom, they're blocking access to the bedroom. Well, this one here, you still got a nice size bathroom with a ceramic tile floor, and everything's enclosed in the side, so if somebody's in the restroom taking a shower, getting ready, they're not blocking access to the rest of the RV. And what you can do is actually open this door up. It gives you a little bit of a privacy screen if you need to run to the bedroom to get dressed. Dice RV, folks, 2004 Safari 36 PDD Sahara, certified pre-owned with a warranty. It was priced thousands under NADA. I'm sorry I didn't have a chance to print one out, but I did look it up, and it was over 70000 And that's for a used one, not, not a certified pre-owned. That's actually worth a little bit more. This one's only 64.9 with 36,000 miles. You know, if you're looking for a trouble-free motorhome and get a want a warranty and all that stuff you really need to take a long hard look at this one folks because this is a high quality brand that somebody has taken exceptional care of and it's priced way under market value especially for a certified pre-owned 36,000 miles 350 cummins two slides full body paint two hundred thousand dollar motorhome new and like i said folks it's going to have a new tv in it and the two new wheel centers for the front wheels so it's going to be as perfect condition as we can possibly make a 2004 model to be and it's going to have a warranty because you know it's the best of the best because it qualified for cpo status give us a call 706-965-7929 evenings and sundays 423-605-6747 up to 15 year financing is available on this rv at very very low interest rates because it is a certified pre-owned to actually get a little bit of a I think a half a point or half a percent less interest rate because of the CPO status. And if you just need a short-term loan, folks, I've got a credit union that is doing 2.5% on 60 months, which even if you're a cash buyer, 2.5% uh, for 60 months, it's a pretty attractive offer, uh, especially if you've saved up 65 grand cash and you don't want to, and, you, and I don't know about you, but I can take that 65 grand and, and make a lot more money off of it than what I'm going to spend at two and a half percent interest rate on a 60 month loan. So another great option that we offer, you get a warranty with it. My RV techs are going to go through it, go beyond what the, uh, the warranty and the certification company requires for a checklist. Our checklist is over 200 points and everything's going to work perfectly folks. Now we don't check them out till we sell them and it's paid for. So you know, it takes us about a week to check over one of these diesel motor homes because of all the systems. I actually take this to a diesel shop and have the chassis gone over by a diesel shop and a, and a certified diesel mechanic before I even get started on the checkout. So that's why it takes us about a week to 10 days to check one of these diesels out, folks. But when you pick it up, you're going to be well, well impressed for what you're buying. I mean, this is pretty much going to be a turnkey motor home and everything's going to be guaranteed to work and you do get a warranty to back that up 706-965-7929 is our phone number evenings and sundays sales help is available at 423-605-6747 our website's parkwayrvcenter.com we've got over 150 used rvs in stock more arriving daily uh, now folks the holidays are coming up 
today's December 20th, so we will be closed for Christmas Eve on through uh, the first of the next week. Then we'll be open for a few days and op and closed from New Year's Eve until January 4th, I believe, the following Monday. So if you want to come during the holiday season, best to call, make an appointment to make sure somebody's going to be here because next week between Christmas and New Year's, we're going to have a very, very limited staff and best to make an appointment. Uh, that way you know you're going to get the attention you need and deserve because I really look for us to be busy during that time. We normally close between Christmas and New Year's, but we decided to change it up this year a little bit. Give us a call, folks. You'd be glad you did. We're a 47-year-old family-owned and operated used RV, actually 48 years now. We sell over 500 used RVs a year. We've sold tens of thousands over the last 48 years. And for almost half a century, folks, we have been the place to go to to save the most money on a quality used RV. You know, people don't buy 500 RVs a year from us if they just because they like us. They buy that many RVs a year because they can't beat our prices or the quality of our used RVs. Uh, we have a very stringy, we only put the best out here for sale. Very, very picky about what we offer to our customers. In fact, what most dealers buy for their used inventory, we turn down. Probably about 8 out of 10 uh, RVs that most other dealers would buy, we turn down because we only buy the best of the best for our customers and we sell them for less. And if you don't do that, folks, you're not going to be in business long at all. When you've been in business half a century like us, you know you're going to get the best possible deal and the best possible motorhome out there on the used market. And hence, our new certified pre-owned program that we actually go through that most dealers won't go through the time and trouble or the money to do. 64.9, we'll trade. Give us a call. No commission salespeople, so no sales pressure. No interest rate markup. No extra fees, no dock fees, no prep fees, no dealer fees whatsoever. The sales price is what you pay, folks, and if you're a Georgia buyer, since we're a Georgia dealer, you'll pay sales tax. Everybody else, you'll pay the sales tax in your own state. If you buy from an RV dealer who charges you anything else besides the sales price and, and any sales tax that you might owe, they're ripping you off, folks. Uh, all those fees they charge you, dock, prep, uh, tag and title fee or whatever other kind of name they come up for fees they're all rip off fees they're completely 100 percent dealer profit and 100 percent unnecessary to purchase a used or even a brand new rv so don't fall victim to that rv fee scam that other dealers use it's just not a it's not how you're supposed to do business folks you you to be in business like we have you've got to treat people right you got to have the best prices and the best rvs out there and that's exactly what we do and that's why we've been in business for almost half a century Give us a call. You're going to be glad you did. We're going to save you a lot of money. I don't care if you live 3,000 miles away. We're going to save you a lot of money. Make it worth your while to come to Ringgold, Georgia to buy your next used RV. You can fly into Chattanooga, Tennessee Airport. I have four or five customers flying a week. We'll pick you up for free during business hours, bring you back here. And once we, after it's been checked out, my RV techs will go over it with you, show you everything works, and you drive it home. You can fly in Chattanooga, Tennessee from pretty much anywhere in the country for a few hundred bucks. Small airport. You don't have all the security and the lines like you do at Atlanta and these other big airports. And it costs you about the same to fly in there as anywhere else. And like I said, we'll pick you up for free, bring you back here. It's 10 minutes from us and drive the RV home. Doesn't get any easier than that. Plus, you save thousands of dollars. Thank you for watching my video. Hope to see you soon here in beautiful Ringo, Georgia. And if, you, if I happen to uh, not do another video till Christmas, wishing everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you for watching.